Come on. Well, hold on, let me let them on so we can let them know who we're gonna use for our wash day today. Hold the cat, baby. No, no, it's wet. So just be with that torch. It's gotta dry. It's to dry. So this is actually her hair after um the swim cap. If you just watched our live when we did the swimming. Uh, she had that swim cap on, and I can show you again. It is swim on. And they do have an Instagram and a TikTok as well. They do have a YouTube, um, but I think um, they're probably best to get in touch with via Instagram. But as you can see, her hair is pretty much dry. It did a good job. So, uh, Obviously, I have to wash her hair. We just got out of the pool, but also is is wash day. So when I do her lessons, I like to do them on Fridays and Saturdays, back to back, so she gets used to that. Today we are going to be using Miel Miel, however you pronounce it. Um, this right here is some good, good, good conditioner. She actually has a very good line, so we're gonna use that, her conditioner, and her leave-in. I am not going to go live and finish doing the blur drying because, like I said earlier, I want to make a tutorial using that um, that dryer with the brush on the end. Put my AirPods in. That way, you guys aren't just hearing it. Pop a toe the whole time. Um, I do wash her hair on warm water. Not cool because she has low porosity hair. We are not going to use um, the steamer today. We're actually going to use steam caps, and I will show you that. It is actually a heating conditioning cap that you put on. So I'm going to use that instead today. So, as always, I always test the water on my wrist. Make sure that the water is not too hot, not too cold. Nobody wants to be shocked when I'm getting their hair washed. Awesome. I usually put some uh, cotton balls in her ear, but so I guess she's over that now. She doesn't want to do that anymore. Whatever. It's her world, and I'm just living in it. What can I say? Please let me know if you have any questions. Our next giveaway will be the Shampoo Buddy, and probably not until July or August, but it will be the Shampoo Buddy. And it will be worldwide as well. So that's a good thing. And so there's a comment. Uh, where do you get the wash? Oh, from Shampoo Buddy, and that is ShampooBuddy.com. All one word, ShampooBuddy.com. I was, it's funny you mentioned that. I just was saying how we're going to do a giveaway for one. They come in all kind of colors, blue, gray, purple. Uh, at one point, you also could get them on Amazon. So I would go to Amazon first to see. I think she had them on Amazon as, as well. And it's literally Shampoo Buddy, B-U-D-D-Y. <sighs> Patience. 
So this is a moisturizing shampoo. Uh, because we have been swimming for two days, I definitely want to get that moisture back in there. She, her hair was in a protective style all week. And that was lovely. I'm going to show you that what I put in my hand is going to literally wash her hair, her entire head. So I'm not going to have to add more at all. So whenever you're washing, you want to go from the out to the end. As you can see, I'm moving. And the soup, the soap will eventually get to the middle. I'm showing extra love to the edges because they were the ones that got damp under the cap. So I want to make sure I get all that chlorine out of her hair. I also wash my hair, my locks with this shampoo. I'm only going to do one good wash because as you can see, it is lathered up real nice and good. Just show some extra love. Really massage that scalp. A, B, C, D. In the morning, brush your teeth. That's my jam. That's our jam. Can y'all tell? <laughs> On the double. I don't put my nails in her scalp. I put the bed of my nail right here in her scalp. I mean, underneath, I should say, the skin of my nail. Underneath. She is living a life, you're right. <laughs> uh, yes, she is. Yes, she is. Thank you. I have been using Shampoo Buddies. We started off with a gray one. I have been using these since she was like five months old. I love this shampoo caddy. Thank you. You are welcome. Absolutely. Hopefully you find it. They're not hard to find. She does ship worldwide as well. She did mention to me that uh, at one point, you know, like as we all have probably endured customs with having some issues, uh, shipping things, things getting stuck, stuff like that. Um, but she said it that it hasn't been in a while so if you are out of the country and you want one just be aware that is a possibility that it could be delayed getting to you because of the whole covid and customs and all that jazz that we've been living through for the last three years <laughs> As you guys see, I kind of split my hand in her hair and make sure that I'm getting all through there. It's a lot of hair, it's very thick, and you will think you are clear. And you go to who part and there is conditioner or soap in there and I'll be like, ah you have to actually come to this back to the shampoo bowl before 
So like when I'm done, I don't immediately take the shampoo bowl down because I've had to return to get some things out of her hair. So, but I want you to notice the shine already just from the shampoo on her hair. Hopefully you guys can see that. Um, that is a very, very good moisturizing shampoo. Almost. I got to put your conditioner on. Oh, no. <laughs> You're silly. You're silly girlfriend. Hey, I love it. I know I love, love, love these kind of nozzle bottles. So they're just so easy. Makes my life easy. I always put the conditioner around the perimeter first and work my way in. So when I need to part it, it is not harsh on her or her hair. This smells really good. It's pomegranate. Smell good, baby? Uh -huh. Yeah, it does. It smells like a candle. Mm. <laughs> Smell like a candle, think about that. See how easy that is now that I can just part it with my fingers. Because I have added some conditioner to her hair. So I'm not going I saw a video like that. I was like, oh my God. Ouchie. Poor baby. Our poor person was an adult, but still, that had to hurt. Oh, come on. Getting low. Getting low. So I always start off I detangle with my fingers first. Best way to detangle. So I hear. So I hear, so I hear, so I hear. Her hair was up in a protective style. She should have some shedding. She doesn't ever have a lot of shedding, which is a good thing. That's always a good sign. So you can see my hand is going through her hair pretty easily. I'm getting low on conditioner. That's no bueno. Alright, I think see. Hand going through. Very good. Even on the bottom. Very good. good. Always love my see it's it's, that's some good conditioner. Shower comb from Coco Pie Pearls. Okay, yep. And you guys can see. Super easy to comb. Paw Patrol is always on the roll. <laughs> Hopefully everybody has a good Memorial Day weekend, long weekend for me anyway. I love a three-day, four-day weekend from work. Yes, Lord, I do. So I'm going to have to open this nozzle to get all of the conditioner out. I'm going to have to order some more. Uh, 
so yeah, this is detangling pretty good. Hold my finger. And I'll show you any shedding that she has. Chill out, chill out. What's too much? My bad, it's just too much. So this is, I don't know if you can see it, but it's not a lot of shedding she has. Let me see if I can put it together. But that's it. And her hair was up and uh get a neck down. I don't want to put it down my sink. Her hair was up and it protected stuff for almost a week. So that's really, really, really good actually. Uh, if you want to comb through the comb, I mean with the comb after your fingers, that's up to you. But as you can see, it's not really making a difference because I detangled it really well with my fingers. I can already see the comments. Um, that noise made my dog go crazy. <laughs> uh, so you know what our dog endures, right? On a daily. I feel I need massage her. Yeah. Yes. I'm giving you a massage. Oh, man. Does that feel good? It does. Um, oh, I'm tripping. I was going to rinse this out. Oh, my gosh. I'm sleepy. I was about to rinse this out. I did not want to rinse this out. I want to put the decaf on it. So I'm going to uh, now use, I'm just massaging that in. I'm going to now use the uh, heat seam cap from Afro Seam Cap. And then I'm going to, uh, so this is Afro Seam Cap. And like I said, we're not using a steamer today. Cause we're just gonna put this cap on. I'm gonna let it sit on her hair for 15 minutes. It comes like this. They also come in different colors as well. And it comes with this on it to put over her head. We're gonna put the cam the same cap on, okay? Go ahead, sit up, chica. You want some strawberries? So usually I let her um, have a snack while it's on. Uh, buy her some time. You want, huh? What's the name? McDonald's. McDonald's is for lunch. Do you want a snack before we go to McDonald's? After we do your hair. And we got to go to the mall, remember? So do you want a snack or no? No, it's McDonald's. Okay, you don't want a snack until we get to McDonald's? No. Okay, turn around. So, no, no, no. You don't touch it. So here's the string, and you just pull it. As you can see, it made it tight. And then I always uh, have hers on low, but it's uh, low, high, and then off. And then I let it sit for 15 minutes. Um, it's 11.38, so around uh, 12 o'clock, I will wash it out, and then I'll put the leave in, and then I will just, uh, and I'm going to use the dryer, the dryer to blow her hair out today. Uh, does having eczema affect hair growth in children or in general? Uh, you know what? I don't know. That's a good question. I've had a lot of relatives, especially little uh, little ones with eczema, but I don't think I've ever really noticed a difference. You know, 
um, if, if their hair uh, was affected by it. Because I don't know, I don't think I've ever seen it in the head per se. I've always seen it like on the legs and the arms and the tummy. Um, so I don't know, but I'm going to research that now that you say that because I am a research guru. <laughs> I love to look up stuff. This, um, but that's a good question. That's a very good question. Uh, luckily, so I, when I was, um, of course, again, my researching of uh, breastfeeding, I, because I wanted to see what all I can use the breast milk for, because I was what they call an oversupplier, and one of them was for skin. It asked, it told me to bathe her in the breast milk, like the expired breast milk, because if it's expired, is is expired for her to drink per se, but not to use for other things. And I used that for um, to bathe her in because I heard on the research it said that it actually um, decreases the uh, possibility of eczema and then if you did have it that it helped clear it up so i thought huh but she's never had any skin issues um you know other than like getting out in the sun too long or something like that typical stuff but not too many issues though you made a live we glad you made it <laughs> what was that D- dynasty well welcome dynasty um we actually went live earlier we were doing a swim lesson i was showing you guys how i do her swim lessons and then doing this but like i said before i'm not going to show the end i'm going to actually record using the hair dryer so i can do the tutorial and post that um if your child has eczema issues on the scalp yes breast milk is healing wow i want to go live without you saying it one day so, uh, 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 uh. Um, I didn't know that. So let me repeat that so everybody can know. If your child has eczema issues on the scalp, yes, breast milk is healing. Um, like I said, I know that it was healing for the skin because I researched that when, but I was bathing her in it. I was like using, uh, we, I use cocoa butter on her skin. I would mix it with the cocoa butter. Let me tell you all something. I would do a facial with it. We was using that breast milk for everything. <laughs> you name it, we used it. <laughs> Not a problem at all. Want juice? Not a problem at all. So today we're going to go run some errands and charge the car and Get some Legos. She wants some more Legos. So I'm going to buy her some Legos. She's on the Legos now. But she's building her butt off. So she's doing a pretty good job. Um, so uh, Afro Steam Cap, uh, guys, they actually sell uh, some other different things as well. But I actually, I really like this cap. Um, I've used it on my locks before um, as well. And really easy uh and, you know, you can just sit down and watch TV or whatever, like she's doing while it's on there. I let mine sit on for 30 minutes, but, of course, I don't let her sit on for 15 minutes. Let me show you again. That's an Afro steam cap. So this is what I use when I don't feel like putting the steamer out, turning it on, blah, 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 blah. Um, and, if, and it lets me also do other things that I need to do sometimes if, while she's doing that. You know, um, if she wants a snack, she can have a snack. Uh, whatever the case may be, but I might need to like, you know, finish putting the laundry up or anything that I'm doing um, while she's under that is convenient for me. So that's the good thing. Um, So let me show you again what I use today. This is, uh, again, my moisturizer. So, you know, you have moisturizing shampoos and then you have uh, clarifying shampoos. Uh, clarifying shampoo strips all of the oils and everything out of your hair, especially if you have uh, if you have hair that has a lot of uh, product buildup. I tend to do that. My hair holds oils like crazy. Um, so sometimes I have to clarify my locks uh, because my scalp is like, yucky, yucky, yucky. 
So, but then you have moisturizing shampoos that, of course, like it says, moisturizing and adds moisture back into the hair. And so this is uh, one of Miel's. And as, like I said, this is a really, really, really good one. If you, are pro if you are familiar with her line, you know that she has several different types of lines within one line. And this is her pomegranate conditioner. It smells so good. As you can see, when I was putting it on, I was able to detangle with her with my fingers just fine. Like I said, I always go around the perimeter first and then work my way in. That way, when I'm parting, it's not ripping her hair or anything. Afterwards, I'm going to put this leave-in conditioner in um, her hair. And then I'm going to section it off and then blow it out with that dryer with the comb with the brush on the end from embrace your curls but like i said that will be again a tutorial so it will not be on live um i'm going to do some pros and cons on both that and the red there uh to compare everybody kind of they said it it was like those two are in competition i wasn't aware of that i just happen to have both so let's talk about it right let's talk about both um, you know, some people always ask me about the loudness. I mean, both of them are just, you know, no louder than any other type of hair dryer or blow dryer. Even when I'm sitting under my hooded dryer is loud. So drying your hair is loud. <laughs> I mean, that's just what it is, right? Drying your hair is loud. That's just what it is. Um, in the future, like I said, let's talk about some giveaways. We're going to do a giveaway for the shampoo buddy. <clears throat> And as you can see, this thing does not slide. It's on here. It doesn't uh, mess up your countertop in any way at all. Uh, when I take it off, I just wipe it out with some Clorox spray or any type of cleaning spray or sometimes just a, wipe, um, a Clorox wipe. Just wipe it out and then I put it away in the shelf in her bathroom until next time. Super easy to use, super easy to clean. And super easy to store. So, um, Donna, see you laughing. Because people are there always like, is it loud? It is loud. It's going to be loud to dry your hair. That's just what it is. You know what I mean? It's, that's just what it is. <laughs> it's just what it is, right? Um, and like I said, they're, they're both loud. You know what I mean? One's bulkier than the other. Um, but as far as sound, they, they're both loud to me. And I don't even have good hearing. I can't even hear really good in my right ear. So, you know. Um, the um, Thank you all, everybody, everybody who uh, entered into the giveaway for the Rev Air. We really appreciate it. That one was a fun one. That was a really, really fun giveaway for me. I love all of the notifications I received. Every day I woke up, I'm, I mean, thousands of notifications. Uh, but hearing, listening to the positive was always, was, was super nice. I love it. Um, that keeps your energy going. And especially people like me who now have to go back to the office after working from home for so long. My soul is broken. <laughs> but I must say, it is, it is nice to get up and actually put on clothes now and get dressed and wear some makeup and some heels and, you know, things that I forgot I even had in my closet. And I'm like, oh, yeah this in two or three years so that's a good thing but thank you for all um for entering into the giveaway i really appreciate that and like i said we have this one coming up and it's going to be exact same um except it'll be worldwide so that's a good thing so that's going to be that's going to up the competition because again it's worldwide right um we Cocoa Pie Curls, um, let me know that she's got some new things coming up. I'm, a, I'm very excited about that. She makes some very good products. So uh, don't squeeze it, Miha. No, it's not done. Put it in there. Like that, and then fold it back. Like that. There you go. She makes some very good products. So I'm excited to continue to work with them and show you guys the new products that we're going to have. Um, and um, I'll reach out to her as well after the Shampoo Buddy as far as another giveaway for any new products that she has that she wants people to try. That's always a good thing. Um, let's see. So 
someone had asked me before about the towel that Olivia had on her head. And it's just a microfiber towel. Um, you want to dry your hair with microfiber, not a regular cotton towel. Cotton towels can cause a lot of frizz um, and dryness to your hair. And you don't want to do that. So you want to use a microfiber towel. I actually got this from Embrace Your Curls. I got to think about it. Um, and it's really soft, really, really good. But you know what? Amazon. Amazon has them. Many, many. For probably cheap. Probably cheap. But uh, Embrace Your Curls has some pretty ones <laughs> if you want to go on there. And that is Embrace Ya. Y-A Curls. C-U-R-L-Z. Um, I like them. They also have the clips, like the hair dryer I'm going to use. They have a lot of supplies, uh, hair supplies that you need for natural hair. They are your supplier. And that is uh, Embrace Your Curls. So you do want to get your microfiber towel to dry your hair. You don't want to use a cotton towel at all. I don't even use that on my locks at all. So, but this is nice and warm. Love it, love it, love it. I can feel it. I always keep her near. Um, when I am doing something, if I'm doing something, I always put her in a place I can watch her so she's not messing with the plug. We've had talks about the plug. She's uh, pretty good at um, knowing safety things that good. Um, so she doesn't usually typically, uh, touch those things now that she's older. <laughs> so, oh, 10 minutes now. Let's see. I'm ready to get in these streets and spend unnecessary money. How about you, mommy? Are you ready to get in these streets and spend unnecessary money? I All done. A McDonald's? A McDonald's? Well, I <laughs> I told her, guys, if she did good in the water today and she kept going underneath the water, she would get McDonald's. McDonald's is a treat. Well, <laughs> mommy, mm -hmm. go to okay, today. after you're after I promise it and I and I'm going to live by it. I promise. So her hair, guys, is really warm. It's super soft, as you can see. Loving it. Still detangled. Super soft. I wish you guys could see how soft it is. And you can see those curls. Uh, I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Uh, if you can see, this is what I mean by her having two different curl patterns. So look at her, look at her curl pattern um, on, my back. on the bottom. You see how big that is. And then you go up here and you see her curl pattern is tighter and then up here it's super tight crazy right but yeah that's her that's her curl pattern on the bottom funny funny okay i'm gonna go ahead and wash it out okay mommy let's lean back let's here, grab your phone Let's rinse it out so we can go be. Huh. One, two, three. Good job, Chica. So again, super soft. Still detangled. Fingers going through. Nice. And her hair was very warm. Gonna rinse this out. I am going to add her leave in in the bowl once I kind of warm. Okay, mommy. Mommy, turn your phone. Or my phone. Okay. I like this conditioner. I still stick by Coco Pytel. So if you've ever tried that conditioner, my mom tried it on her. She was like, oh my God. I said, I know, I know, I know. It is a business. 
All righty. <laughs> and that is our wash day, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to add the leave in and then going to continue on our day. He's going to do a big hair on K today. If any product to give her hair shine and silk, I love it. It's my thing. It is my thing. So I want to make sure that the conditioner, I know it's going down to the end. I want to make sure that it gets rinsed out on the ends as well. And there we go, guys. So, you guys, so soft, full of body, full of life, elasticity, is healthy. So this is just a leave-in. I like this leave-in. It could be, it could have been a spray, as you can see. It's light. It's light. So, it could have been a spray, but, you know, she put it in a nozzle, whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever. It's not a your typical cream type, as you can see. Not too much. Just kind of put it in there. Hey, are Wrap it around, pull it down, wrap it around the bottom. And so, there she goes. All right, mommy, can you turn around and say bye bye? Thank you. Hey, thank you. I don't think she's a comedian like her daddy, y'all. Pray for her. But thank you guys so much. I appreciate everybody for coming on. And we will drop this tutorial tomorrow. I got it. It's just a comb. I got to clean it out. Uh, we will drop this tutorial tomorrow on the blowout. And I will go live probably tomorrow so we can talk about... No, 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 come on. That's... We don't want to get that way. So we can talk about... Um... 
the pros and cons of the rev air and everything like that. So until next time, guys, thank you so much and namaste. namaste. <laughs>